Hello and welcome back. We're in Beyond Earth and there's a war going on. And I'm a bit pumped for war because I just finished recording Civ 5 and at the end of my session, which I'm pretty sure uh, that episode will be up before this one, so there shouldn't be any need for spoilers. I invaded Belgium! Which, if you told me that a month ago, I would not have believed to be true. Seriously, it's been a big turnaround for my opinion of Belgium, as well as my opinion for the Ottomans in that game. But whatever, I'm not here to talk about other series. Let's focus more so on the one at hand. Crusader Kings 2! Ha <laughs> ha, that, that was a joke. A bad one. What? Sorry. It, I'm, I'm a bit tired. I'm a bit tired and I don't know what to talk about. Right now. I, I, I want to find something to talk about. I'm just not sure what that something is, is best to be. Well, I don't know. I, I brought up CK2. My, uh... My Crusader Kings 2 series where I play as the, uh, the Coronians and try to get attacked in a crusade and then win the war. And if I lose, probably get stronger and try again. Something along those lines. Honestly, uh, my CK2 series, I, I, I really wish more people watched because, um, well, I really like that series. Seriously, I, I, I have a lot of fun. It, it's really a fantastic game. I mean, it's, it's convoluted it, and not incredibly easy to get into, but once you have a firm understanding of the game, it, it's just... It's really fun is the point I'm trying to get across. And I really enjoy playing it. And you guys should watch it. I, I mean, I, I don't... I don't usually like, um... like to try to self-promote because, you know, that... that's lame. I, I, I don't want to seem like a desperate person. I, I'm just saying... I enjoy the series. I... I, I would really... It would really make me feel good if the series I enjoy doing uh, was something that other people enjoyed watching as much as I enjoyed doing it. Yeah, and I mean, sure, because of my technical limitations, I do kind of record the episodes in, uh, in low frame rates, but to be fair, all my videos are in low frame rates. Right now, Beyond Earth has, is at 11 frames per second. Oh, wait, it just jumped up to 12! Out of what I really should... Out of what really should be 30 frames per second. At the bare minimum. Yeah, but don't worry, that's only going to last as long as I have to do that on this really crappy computer I'm playing on. Now, and at my current income, I'll be able to afford a good gaming computer. Um, I'm going to refuse this time and see what happens with my allies. Which, at my current income, I'll be able to afford a, a good gaming computer sometime around 2000 and never. Uh, again, that was a joke. I'm in college, you see. I can't really get 
together the kind of money that I need for that. Um, but luckily, you know, I, I should be able to do pretty fine once I, I finish college in just like two and a half more years. I mean, I, I, I was actually, I'm actually in a position, let me take a look at this auto plant thing. I want to see what it does. Auto plant, that's uh, just straight up production. Production is usually more valuable than energy. Although we're actually down energy a little. So, yeah. Anyways, I'm I'm actually I'm in the middle of my first year at college and it's actually looking like so long as I I pass all my classes, which I see no reason why I would not be able to. I should get my, uh, m my associate's degree in only one year of college, which is actually a pretty big deal. I, I mean, it's thanks almost entirely to, uh, to, uh, my, my high school career because, um, I took several uh, advanced placement courses in high school. So I got a lot of free college credit. Also, I'm smart, so I was able to place into pretty high um, courses in my college to, uh, to help me get some free retroactive credits as well. And luckily, those three years of Spanish I took in high school is going to pay off because I can jump straight into a higher level Spanish class and get multiple credits from that. And that's going on for me in this semester. I, I actually, a few days back, although by the time this goes up a few weeks back, uh, wound up taking a Spanish exen entrance exam so that I could get into one of those higher level classes. Whatever, I'm, I'm thinking my, um, my aptitude at doing school along with the fact that I also happen to be an Eagle Scout should make a, a resume look pretty good once I finish up with college. Although, really, I should be getting a job before college ends. Because college is expensive. My parents don't have enough money to bankroll the whole thing. Just the first year. Just the first year, and... I... I, I just realized... I spent this entire... Entire episode talking about how good I am at stuff. I, honestly, I, I didn't even really realize I was I was doing that. I I, I, I don't I I don't usually like to think of myself as as being as being particularly egotistical or. Or, or anything like that, I just... Crap, why did I have to choose that to talk about? I, I mean, I didn't even really choose. I, I was just kind of thinking about it and it can't... I'm sorry. I'm sorry, people. I feel bad now. Hmm... 
Do you think we could besiege this city here, Sarek? See now, I don't know. Shit, we're really close to their capital. Um. Yeah, j just just forget everything I I said earlier in the episode about about college and, and stuff because y you know that that's not what what's important. Okay. Fuck. Manticore, right on the spot where I want to plop the city. Well, I guess we're just gonna have to wait a little bit. Wait for it to go away. Before we can build this new city which we desperately need built. Hello? Oh, they're not the ones we're at war with. Ah, shit. Well, made a huge mistake there. Huge, huge mi- Well, okay, not that big a mistake. Just... Gonna need to uh, move around and head towards Brasilia. And you, why don't you just heal up? You're no good to me, half dead. We'll be getting attack jet, attack jet next turn, so we can try blowing the Manticore out of the, you know, to smithereens. My cooperation agreement with the Cavathon Protectorate is over now. Hmm. I think... To protect our settler, because all we gave... Ah, shit. All we gave him was an explorer to protect him. Uh, fortify. That's not going to turn out very well. Not going to turn out very well at all. Actually, we want to move you forward. So... Yeah, let's do that. Where were you two? Uh, were you... Yeah, Kiyagungan. Let's, uh, let's keep our trade partners supplied. After all, there's a lot that they have to offer us. Yeah, since you don't have enough range, why don't you just sleep? And hope things do not turn too bad for... For this new city we're gonna try to build. It's really tense. I'm, I'm particularly worried. But I think... Let's just move the colonist and the explorer back. 
until we can get this missile rover that we're building over here to kill the um for a few seconds we were at zero FPS and again zero FPS and again zero FPS this is getting really annoying I think maybe I should cut the recording off um, yeah, there's a good chance my hard drive is full by now. So, um, anyways, I am Lord Ravenwork, this is and then Audacity broke. The end.